In today's tutorial video, we are going to discuss how to read the electrical wiring diagram of a machine. A reading and electrical diagram is really important for the automation, control and commissioning engineers to understand how the input and output field devices are connected to the controllers. Electrical wiring diagram shows how the PLC controller and field level instruments sensors, transmitter, VFDs, and motors are wired together. Having the understanding of how to read electrical wiring diagram is really important to troubleshoot the machine. In today's tutorial, we will try to learn how to read the electrical wiring diagram using a real-world example. For example, if we have a motor installed in the machine and if you look closer, we have a tag attached to the cable of the motor with M142 mentioned on it. Now question here is that where this cable is connected in the machine electrical panel and how does the PLC is controlling this motor? For this, we need to understand how to read the electrical diagram. If we see the sheet of the electrical wiring diagram, every sheet has a unique number mentioned on the right bottom corner of the page. So all sheets in the electrical diagram has a unique number just like any normal book. Next thing you can see at the top of the sheet. This sheet is divided into some vertical columns. Starting from column number 0 all the way up to column number 9. Same way if you look at the left side of the sheet, this sheet is divided into some rows horizontally. Starting from A, B, C and up to F. These rows and columns together make a grid on the sheet. This grid makes it easier to locate objects on this sheet. Now we have some basic information about the electrical diagram sheet. Next very important thing is that all field devices, wiring, controllers, power supplies will be mentioned or represented on this sheet in the form of symbols. So, before going into electrical wiring diagram, we should know the basic symbols of the electrical devices like push buttons, contactors, power supply and the motors. 